What is up, YouTube? Alphonse is a team great lock. Oh man, first time I did a YouTube video in quite a while. Welcome back to my nice YouTube. So, I guess you're wondering what's been happening with Team Greylock as of late. For the past few weeks or maybe months or so, we definitely had some buddy heads. Of course, deciding what locals to go to, prepping for Team League, organizing teams, all that stuff. But fortunately, this is just what every team goes through. Eventually, there will be a time where we will butt heads, and eventually, there will be a time where we'll have to say what we gotta say, and then hopefully, we can just get over it, acknowledge it, and move forward to the next event. So, of course, we can always reference Team Q4. Hey, Kamui and Kai would definitely not best buds right off the bat. And even with Team still undecided in the G Series, they have their conflicts as well. But fortunately, hopefully, this team, we can be the same, we can just get over it, and move on to the next level. So, I guess what you're wondering, what's going to be the team of Great Lock doing now? Well, there's going to be a very big weekend for all of us. There's going to be at least three different groups, or at least three different sections of the team that will be doing different things. The first off will be the Bushiro Spring Fest in White Plains, New York. The last Spring Fest in North America. This is going to be a major one. It's probably going to be the most competitive because you are featuring a tri-state area of competitors from all three card games from Bushiro, Cartwright Vanguard, Future Card Buddy Fight, and Vice Sports. It's going to be insane, it's going to be a lot of salt, and it's going to be a lot of crazy things going on. So, a good majority of our section will be attending Spring Fest. Most of them will be for Cartite Vanguard, and I think a few others will also stay for Buddy Fight, and I'm not sure if anyone's going to go for Vice Sports on Sunday. But whatever the case is, I'm sure that they will be sporting the Team Great Lock match, and I'll be also requesting them to see if they can make a quick vlog as to their progress. I'll probably just ask them on the way to the regional, maybe before the pre-reg li uh, pre line starts, and see what happens. Hopefully it will be uh, an interesting compilation I can do together and don't forget guys, keep your phone on the side. You don't want that vertical camera. I can't edit that much space in there. So that's one section of our team. The other section of our team will actually be traveling down to the ARG Edison for Force of Will. Force of Will has had a crazy start. It's been a crazy couple of months because now we already have already our own ARG circuit. This is probably one of the fastest times I've seen that ARG picked up a trading card game and Force of Will has been popping quite a bit in our locals. So, a section of our team will be at the Force of Will event and if you see anybody from there, you can always feel free to check out our past videos to know who our members are and just stop by and say hi. I'm sure they either have their team great lock play match or you probably recognize them by their face or their voice. So, that's two of our teams. And then the third one, which is kind of like me, forever alone type of thing. So, I will actually be attending Anime Next. I've always gone to Anime Next every single year since 2010. It's been like my staple con that I always go to. And I'm going to bring a lot of cosplays with me. And by a lot, I just mean three. One of them is going to be Brock from Pokemon, my, one of my favorites that I've done almost every single year. Uh, my second and third, they're actually going to be new cosplays that I'm going to debut. One I actually debuted at the Sexy Nerds cosplay party uh, a month or two back, which is Liu Kang, the Mortal Kombat 4 version, because that's the only one that actually has a top on that's his main costume. And I, I, I try to work it out. Anyways. But the third one is going to be the Conco Admiral. I actually ordered the costume off of HalloweenCostume.com, and I'm trying to get it edited and fitted for tomorrow. So I'll be also taking that guy out as well. So, yeah, three cosplays planned for the weekend, and probably going to be a lot of shenanigans. Hopefully I get to record a lot of videos, and maybe get to see what it looks like. And maybe I probably might enter a few tournaments as well, if time, you know, can give me a break or something like that. So, that's pretty much what's happening. Uh, I'm probably going to enter the Card Fight Vanguard uh, doubles tournaments that's going to take place on Friday. Uh, as, for fr as for Saturday and Sunday, I'm not sure. Saturday's going to be a little bit packed for me, because I want to do the Misadventures of Rock again, and Sunday... It's going to be the Pokemon vs Digimon Cyber game. So, whatever the case may be, it's going to be that type of schedule. If you actually see me at Anime Next, feel free to stop by and say hi. Don't worry, I don't bite. I'll be more than happy to meet anybody that supports our channel. And at least anybody in general, actually. So, that's pretty much what it looks like for the team as for the next couple days. Now, what you want to know about our Facebook page, our YouTube channel, our Twitch stream. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of stuff we need to do. One of the big problems that I had with trying to record video content was that our resources were definitely dispersed. Uh, a tripod, usually uh, Joe Love has a tripod because really every Sunday now they've been trying to really push the Future Card Buddy Fight stream at Time Warp Comics Game to see grow. It's, it's actually been going on consistently for quite a while and they've been getting a good amount of viewers. So I want to try and support them a lot more with it. However, I do want to try and see if I can get the tripod back so I can try and get to recording some actual video content for YouTube, especially now that you know I have content to record for Twitch and I probably wouldn't want to put up um, a Twitch 
you know, video directly from there and put it on the YouTube and hopefully it does something. But I want to try and record some YouTube exclusive content as well and that's like a major thing. So that is a plan at least for video content and just trying to get all the resources together and then sitting down and actually recording the content as we go along because we've done deck profiles, we've done some box openings but actually having matches that is really one of the toughest parts about recording because to make sure you can record everything that's all good to go and whether you want it live or with commentary it's going to take a lot more time so it really goes into the process of okay how much time can I divest or digest or invest into making this thing a success and it's been harder for me because I've also have I have a full-time job now and it's pretty tough when each time I would wake up go to work around 8 30 stay there until 5 30 or even later and then just come back home see what I can do work out stuff like that so you know I, I it definitely falls the falls with me because I'm still trying to get acclimated into the adult life and yes I'm learning to adults at 24 years old. I'm late, late, better late than never, if anything, I would say. So, that is the focus that we're going for. The Facebook page, there is absolutely no excuse. Even just a status update would do nicely. So, what I want to do is I definitely want to divulge into Team Gridlock. I want them to keep pumping out memes. I want them to keep pumping out video content, card of the days, even, and try and get our page active again. Because definitely we've been following on the inactive side for quite some time, even on the local support. So whatever the case is, if you are in the tri-state area and Team Greyluck is attending your local, well in particular Time Warp, uh, Game On, and maybe uh, Toy Wiz, hopefully you can expand the comics and toys and other locals. But as of right now, we want to make sure we can get our Facebook page active again. So hopefully this gives you an update as to where Team Greylock is, where Team Greylock's near future is, and then what we can do in terms of the big picture future. So whatever the case is, I hope that you are still here for the ride. Thank you for your patience. We really 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 values you the subscribers because we passed 500 subscribers I have absolutely gone bonkers trying to think wow over 500 people actually subscribe to our channel and watch our content and I really don't want to disappoint you guys so hopefully this week will be a pretty good week gonna be a crazy amount of time and whatever the case may be hopefully you will be here for the ride because Team Greylock will be soaring again hopefully soon and that's it for me my name is Alphonse Zeus hope that you've enjoyed this vlog and if you have any questions or comments about whatever I said feel free to comment down below and then we can get a conversation started. So that's it for me. Take care guys. We'll see you next time.